So I have this problem, we have this problem, and uh, to get started, I squared both sides. So to get rid of the radical, uh, problem is I already did this problem, I kind of botched it, so I'm, I have to redo it. That's why I have everything written out. Just FYI. Um, so that we have this, and then I move everything to the right side of the equation where I have my x squared term, and then I factor. And then x would be equal to either um, negative 5 or 3, but you got to be careful here. Um, it's not going to be negative 5, because if you get negative 5, what you end up with is um, you get 25 equal to negative 5, which can't happen. You can't have uh, anything under the radical equal of negative value. You can have an imaginary value, but not a negative value, unless it's something other than, a, than just the square root. But for 15 minus 2 times 3, we get square root of 9, which does equal 3. So our only solution in this case is x is going to be equal to 3. That's it.